day of the new year and the routine to start is shining your suit. So I didn't have any bleach this time around, so I'm actually using white vinegar so it's an antiseptic as well. So I'm going a little bit more natural this time. Those of you that gave me a hard time about using bleach down my sink, there you go. Although I don't see what the difference is between doing that and using bleach in your washing machine to bleach your wipes, because it goes in the drain too. But anyway, okay. so I'm going to do this, fill it up, let it soak for an hour, and then rinse. Alright, my sink is as shiny as it's going to get, but I'm starting off the new year with a shiny sink. Right. Not perfect, but better than where we left last. Um, I also have thrown in a load of laundry that is in the dryer now. So that's going to round up my first day of 2021. Not Hi everybody, it is day two of 2021 and today I'm going to do a load of laundry. Um, we are smoking meats today and we're going to work on a playground if my husband's filling up to it. If not, I'm going to take the, the tree down today and the decorations and all that stuff. Also yesterday I said I was done after I uh, washed or, or shined the sink. I will also do that today as well again. Um, I did a load of laundry uh, and then what was it? Oh yeah I needed to uh, sand down and repolyurethane the uh, butcher block which right. I did. So today I'm going to get started and go from there. I did want to show this real quick because I have not been able to catch up on laundry until this week. I finally did a load a day and just to show you how much a load a day ends up being in the end as it starts to pile back up. So this is actually the load I'm going to do today because it's the highest. But as you can tell, I've done pretty well at keeping up with it. Um, so, and I didn't do the whole week that way. I think it was like the last uh, three days. I did three loads and now this one's piled back up again so it's a constant revolving door with laundry but this is just to help encourage you that just a few days of doing laundry a load a day you'll get caught up pretty quick so that's where I'm at now so I'm going to throw this load in and go from there today. also I forgot to mention this was something else I did yesterday is I just put some of the uh, bleach cleaner toilet bowl cleaner in the toilet and just let it sit. I didn't even scrub it, just let it sit. And then when we used the bathroom the next time, it flushed it down and got it all nice and clean. For the most part, anyway. So, that was just something quick I did yesterday without even thinking about it. Okay, I wanted to come in here and show you guys uh, what is going to be one of my big projects here. Is We got these cabinets at the ReStore. And it's kitchen cabinets, but we're going to use it for storage in here for tools and surplus items we get at Sam's and then laundry stuff of course and so I'm going to paint these uh, a cream color Xander stop kind of an off-white color and um, go with more of an industrial farmhouse look in here and just make it look better in here um, decorative as well as uh, convenient for storage and while I'm in here here's a bag of trash at least it's all bagged up I'm just gonna take it and put it in the trash can there we go the only way to know is to let go and see if it stays okay look oh nope nope here hold it and I'll ice it some more the problem is the icing has to to exactly. dry some, you gotta blow on it. No, don't blow on it. Hold on. Hold on. Just hold Once it upright. Once the icing's there, you blow on it. Hold it upright. Hold it like this. Your brother's mean to you. My Look. boy is mean to you. <laughs> hold it like this. <laughs> Up. You can't hold it like well, you gotta hold it up straight, bud, or it's ne you're never gonna get it up there. He wants to put a Christmas tree on the roof. The roof, the roof is on fire. Oh. 
Patience. I don't have that kind of patience. You got it to stay? Open it. The oh. Christmas tree is on the roof. Don't shake the table. It may fall off. It's not. Now, I think that's probably enough. Oh, dear Lord. <laughs> okay. Wow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> It's staying on. <laughs> hey, it's staying on. Oh well, yeah, it's like glitter. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Remember, every single speck <laughs> that falls off is wasted. Okay, y'all wash your hands now. Give me the icing. I didn't know you could it went on too thick. Uh-oh. <laughs> Sander, it looks like you have little icicles hanging off the roof. <laughs> that was not what you were going for, huh? But that was what I was going for. I need those so I can put. We this. have a pond in the front yard, apparently. <laughs> yeah, we got a pond. Yeah, we got a pond. What kind of pond? We're gonna go sweet in a pond. We're gonna sweet. The tree is inside the bond. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the tree is, is inside the bond and it broke the tree. The, the tree broke in it. And oh, two... What's your goal? Well, that one messed up. That one's pretty good. But, uh. So, so your goal is to kill her in the scarves? Yeah. With a knife. With blue icing. Oh. With blue icing. Blue icing. There we go. Now. Look at that. Look at that. Snow falling down. Snow Yay, falling down. You made two snow bushes. Two I made two snow. tree bushes. Oh. Trees. Oh, yeah. Christmas trees. Whatever I'm trying to say. You made stuff. Yay. Yay. Pretty <laughs> 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 much. Too late. It's all gone now. All right. Yeah, just scrape it off the table now. <laughs> what the heck? What can it is? Yep, your finger's black again. My finger's black again. <laughs> why did, why but is it? But I think it's cool. It's like glitter. And the glitter in the black. I see. Mm -hmm. And that's weird. It looks like a, 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 a what is that? Like? It looks like an ocean <laughs> on top of the gumballs. <laughs> Is that what you were going for, Christian? What? An ocean? No, I was just decorating. Gumballs? Give me some of my gumballs on my sleeves. Give me some of my gumballs on my sleeves. Is that a bush person, Xander? No, that's not a bush person. <laughs> it looks like a bush person. <laughs> oh! I can tell you a bush person. I can you a bush person. Well, what is it? It's a bunch of trees stacked on top of each other with a gumball on top. Is it not a bush person? It's supposed to be tornado. It's supposed to be a tornado. Hmm. Okay, so today I'm doing a organization of our pantry closet. And this is kind of where I am before we start. And so my goal is to declutter in here, get rid of anything that's expired, um, and start putting like things together. Um, those were my tasks for the day. I'm doing a 45 minute declutter thing starting now. 
Okay, this is what I ended up with. Just one three things that were expired. And, um, or we don't eat, which most of it was just expired, which is kind of sad. There's the floor. And then the door. So that's our progress so far. And that was 45 minutes. And I filled up a whole trash can. Here is my sink. It's still not perfect, but this was all gunked up. For some reason, this sink drains really slow. It's like this plug thing isn't tall enough to let everything drain out, especially when I brush my teeth. So that's actually old toothpaste. Um, I ran through with Kaboom to try to get rid of it and this is what's left so far so much better than it was but and I had a feeling it was going to take more than one cleaning with this but that's one of the cleaners I really enjoy is because you can literally just spray and let it sit and let it sort itself out and then just wipe it down real quick so just a little uh tidbit on whenever everything gets really gunked up um you can use that and this is not sponsored by any means but um, it's just something I've noticed is whenever I let things go a little bit, you need a powerful cleaner to get it caught up again. And so that's what I did. Okay. So that concludes week one. So how did it go? Um, week one was about small victories. So I took advantage of doing some cleaning of the house. Whenever I ran into something, I'm like, Oh, I could do that real quick. Let me just do it. So that happened with the toilet and with the sink. That was just spur of the moment kind of things. Um, for big projects, um, I worked in my spare room. I don't think I filmed any of that though. I worked in my uh, spare room getting all the Christmas boxes out of my way so that way I could start putting up the Christmas decorations. I put up the Christmas village and started taking down some of the decorations throughout the house, but I haven't taken down the tree yet. So that's still yet to be done. Um, and then, uh, I started working on organizing the pantry. So I'm taking a four day organizing course that Alejandra does. She does these little mini, mini sessions, which are free, which is nice. Um, I don't know when she's going to do her next one though. <coughs> and the project that I wanted to do was the pantries in the kitchen. So I, we've got a pantry closet and we've got a pantry, um, cabinet. So I'm going to do both right now. I'm just working on the closet though. Um, so I did my first session, which was just 45 minutes. Um, and that's what you saw the before and after of just a little bit ago. So anyway, um, as far as shining my sink, did I do that all week? No, I didn't. Honestly, the reason why is because my mother-in-law takes care of the dishes. That's just her thing. And, um, it was hard to do because she waits till we're going to bed to do the dishes here lately. So, um, I couldn't shine the sink, but I did get a deep cleaning done of the sink, which was good. Um, it needed it. It was starting to lose some of its luster. And so that's now come back and stuff. And honestly, I want to get some Windex so that way I can at least, you know, do a spray down and, and quick swipe of it, I guess, each day, um, just to keep it in good, you know, somewhat good condition. As you can tell, it was scratched up. I don't know why my sink is scratched up, but it is. Um, it just happens. So anyway, um, and then laundry also this week, um, we were closing the month, um, at work. So I didn't get all of it done at, um, home either. So that means now, once again, my laundry is piled up and I will have to deal with that starting next week. However, next week I should start getting off at a decent hour. Um, even Friday I had to work late just cause I was dealing with an urgent issue that needed to get taken care of with one of our customers. So anyway, um, things are going to be a little bit better this week because I'm not going to be working such chaotic hours, which always helps. Um, but that was my first week. Um, all the little snippets I took along the way and then, um, working crazy hours. So <laughs> next week will be better. And that's all you can say is if you have a bad week, you just dust yourself off and say next week will be better. So there you go. So there's my first week of 2021. <laughs>